the first game action of his collegiate career technically came in an exhibition, but it did all seem very real to UMD freshman Alex Fonz. I just wanted to have fun and enjoy it because, I mean, like I said, all the work I put into it, and it's just about, uh, you know, believing in yourself. And For goaltenders, it's also about getting the team to believe in you, and for Fonz, that has already happened. Everyone's behind him, you know, no matter what, and, you know, he proved to us, like, he has been working hard, so it was nice to, you know, get him under, you know, I guess a win under his belt. He's a hard worker. He's kind of very, uh, you know, kind of a quiet guy, but, uh, you know, goes about his business. I think he's been a great team guy. The team is, after all, what matters most. For the goaltenders, though, Fon says it's especially important. You now us three really have to look out for each other without a goalie coach or anything like that. And even at the same point, if you're working hard in practice, you're making the other guys better too. So it's not always about yourself, and you got to look out for the other guys too. You know, friendly competition, I think, is the best thing. You, we got We're all friends, but we're all competitors too, and that's what helps you know push all three of us. That number is worth pointing out. There are three goaltenders on the UMD roster. Generally, only two dress for every game. Obviously, only one can start. For Fonz, though, that high level of competition only made UMD more attractive. And everything from the location of the school and uh, the history of the hockey program and also um, the history of the goalies that they've had with the goalies that are here right now, Aaron and Matt, and then also with Kenny Ryder and Staylock and some of the other guys that have come through here. In Duluth, I'm Zach Schneider for KPGR 6 and range 11.